It's time for my next adventure. The place we are about to see is like the land of the lost. There are rainforests and then there are rainforests. This could be the granddaddy of them all. It's said that this is one of the only primary rainforests that reaches down to the ocean. If you have one rainforest experience to put on your bucket list, this just might be it. The search is on. The air is muggy. Forest thick with bush. Sounds everywhere. And if you look close enough, the jungle stirs. The perfect place for my next adventure. Today's mission, to find the extremely rare red ruff gleamer. But this is not going to be easy since they are few in numbers and live high up in the trees. Overhead isn't the only place you'll find life. In Madagascar, even the ground moves. Look at this, look at this, look at this. This is a tenrec. It's one of the most primitive creatures found on the island of Madagascar. It's actually related to shrews. It's an insectivore. What a little cutie. Oh, he actually impaled me with some of his hairs. They're sharp little hairs that behave like a porcupine quill. They're a unique creature to Madagascar found nowhere else in the world. Wow. This is an exceptional find. What a little cutie. Oh, 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 ah, oh. Okay, time to get back to business, to find the extremely rare red ruff gleamer. This lemur is a strange and exotic sight that very few have ever seen in the wild. It is critically endangered, occupying a small area of the Maswala rainforest. And then, after miles of Madagascar jungle, jackpot! Officially on the endangered species list, there may be less than 500 of these lemurs still in the wild, making this sighting even more spectacular. You have to come here to see it. There's no other place in Madagascar. It's highly restricted. It's a very rare animal. It spends 90% of its time high up in the forest. Fantastic lemur watching. This is one of the prettiest of all the lemurs. It's almost like a child's toy. Their ears look like they've been glued on with crazy glue. They look like teddy bear ears. Their eyes are wide open and alert, as if they've had way too much coffee in the morning. They have a very limited habitat span. They're only found in primary forest, and they're only found way up in the canopy, usually far out of the distance from where you can easily spot them. We've been incredibly lucky today to have them this low. And the reason why they're down this low is because they're feeding on fig. And fig blooms all the way down the trunk of the tree. To see this particular species of lemur, to see it so well, to see it in this forest, it's a life dream come true. For me, this is absolutely profound. I can't tell you how excited I am. <laughs> 